Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Again, excuse the mess. Just, uh, just been waiting to get all the stuff so finally I can just put all of it, you know, just wherever I'm gonna end up putting it, all in one go. So, again, sorry about that. If you like the other background, check out the other videos, you know, or the other future videos because we did just open. Well, I tried to open this, but I, I fucked up and I didn't hit record. So I only got like half the video and realistically speaking, what's the point? So I kind of just ended up scrapping the video and I don't think I'll upload that one, but I do have my, I do have another box of Chainsaw Man, which I will most likely be opening. So if you're into Weiss, definitely check that out. And I do have my second, look at that. What the hell? She's, oh my goodness, I swear. The first box was okay from that vendor, so hopefully we should be good. But anyways, let's actually get into the topic of the video. I didn't want to clap, you know, just in case. Because I hate when people do that. I, you know, sometimes I like wearing headphones most of the time. And when someone does that, I fucking hate it. So, hey, don't worry, I will start with you. But let's actually get to the video. We're talking about Digimon today. We're doing some Egg Seed Apocalypse, which is the newest set, the BT-15, which... I will say I did only get two boxes. I have one on the, what the fuck? What is this? It's like blasphemy. I only got one box topper. Oh man, we went from three box toppers in the last two sets to just one, RIP. And, and it's just a box promo. What the? Oh, this is definitely not it, man. I'm so used to having all the, we got Kyokomon. So we get the, this one. Hopefully it's a good one, but anyways. I'm so used to getting so many box toppers from Digimon. Oh man, that's kind of <laughs> that's kind of disappointing. Hopefully it's not a sign for the box. Hopefully we can get some good. I did check out some of the videos because I did get this one pretty late, and that's some of the what some of the videos I think I said what the hell? some of the Digimon and what the hell did I just get a why did I just get a common foil? Hello. Oh, that's weird. Oh, we got a what the hell? Affimon got an ace version. That's nice. <laughs> Does he have like a dress? What the hell? But anyways, were you guys excited about this set? Uh, in terms of hype, apparently this one is doing I think a little better than Animal Coliseum, but unfortunately, just my luck, I got more Animal Coliseum than this one. So uh, R.I.P. But I did pretty good in those boxes, so I'm not even gonna complain. That rare man, I think it's like forty bucks now. It's insane we got kari and sora the two sisters nice just crazy just for a box topper what that's probably why they stopped doing it people were like bro this is insane we can't keep doing this you can't keep giving us this insane box toppers and digimon probably had to be like oh, oh shit i guess you're right but that's so weird also why am i getting so many foils what the hell this is this is like throwing me off i'm so not used to getting this many foils i think i got four foils in one pack just now what the fuck let's hear let's count first of all four five six seven eight nine ten twelve one, yeah i was gonna say am i tripping yeah no you get way more whoa <laughs> This is definitely a huge uh, shift. What the hell? Maybe people were asking for common foils. I mean, it's kind of nice, though, that you can bling out your... And they probably won't be too costly. You seem to be get them at a pretty generous rate. You seem to get, what, three, four foils now per pack? God damn. So, yeah. It's going to be now super hard to tell the, the supers. Oh, man. I'm going to get clickbaited so hard. We got Cyber or Sign Baron one. Yeah, whoa, well, this is definitely going to get some getting used to. I'm, I wonder if they're going to keep doing this. I wonder if it's going to be, well, I'm guessing, yeah, like, there's, like, why not, you know? Like, there's, I don't think any reason why not have it. Fuck it. Just one of those things that, hey, if you can bling out your deck a little more, and not too expensive, hey, why not? Oh, I think that's a super rare. Let's see. We got Candle, what the, huh? Candle Mon. This looks like one of those uh, incantation monsters. If you play Yu Gi Oh, you'll know what I'm talking about. Sitila Mon, Haguro Mon, Simbira Mon, Gamma Mon, and oh, it's just a rare. I, I got clickbait again. Nice. <laughs> I think I've only gotten one super. We're, we're starting off kind of slow. Hey, it was an ace monster. That's nice. So I'm guessing the ace mechanic is finally taking off. Hey, that's cool. 
how does it work? If you guys know me, obviously let me know. Obviously, I can look it up, but okay, I'm not gonna do that right now. But I'm very curious to see. It does seem like it's actually taking off because they actually are expanding upon it with each set, seemingly, which is good. You know, obviously that would be the the goal. Hopefully, Misty Amon Ace. Well, look at this. Literally looks like a just some dude. That's the thing with Digimon. They never really have like. Obviously, most of them are more like monsters. I would say. Like, I mean, literally look at Garurumon, but or like animalistic slash monster or slash animalistic. I, I guess you could say, but. I guess that's cool that they could also have more humanoid, like actual full-on humanoid, <laughs> which is crazy. Like, look at Angel Mon, you know, or like Angel Woman, I think it's her name. Like, they literally are just, like, damn near people. Well, like angels, but you know what I mean. I mean, that's cool. Just has so much variety. Oh, nice. I'm not gonna lie. I was thinking of waiting to oh man i swear they <laughs> they're so good with clickbait i was thinking of waiting till monday it is now the saturday after so I, like i said i did get it a bit late but i was thinking of waiting till monday because i am getting some other stuff not for this but for other games and i figure i might as well just do one big opening but i don't want to have even more of a mess than i already do so also sorry my energy is a bit low i did just uh Finish packing up a bunch of stuff, so I am a bit tired. But anyways, let's actually get into it. What the hell? I swear. Oh, <laughs> man, I can never go a single box without getting the box character. What the hell? Like literally my first box, I don't even have to open the other one. If I can get like, some good alt arts, man, I might not even open the other one. Look at that. Nice. We got three SRs, all three A's. What the hell? They're really pushing it in this one, huh? Man, I'm so used to saying, like, where's the ace monsters? What the hell? Now, now I'm saying, where's the non-ace monsters? And now that's cool. Like, they're actually trying, you know, to get people to try. Maybe people weren't... <laughs> I'm just that good, huh? Maybe people weren't, you know, willing to give it that much of a chance. Oh, this one's cool. Look at that. Machine drama. So menacing. I also love this one. <laughs> You're clawing out uh, Sukumon. Nice. Yeah, hey, corset. I mean, hey, I'm not gonna lie. The box topper thing kind of, kind of started off my expectations a little lower, because I'm so used to Digimon being the. Ooh, I see something. I see a rainbow. Since it's the first one, I was gonna say, you know what? I'll make you guys wait. But since it's the first one, I won't. Let's actually figure out what what the hell we got. I think it's gonna be a secret rare. Oh no, it's just a super. Rare. See, I'm so used to the Ace ones now. That I they don't foil shine as much as this one's because they have the, like the other color, but this one is just like straight silvery. Look at that, and a classic mon to boot. Classic mon, Digimon. Still relax. No, I <laughs> I didn't call it a Pokemon. Relax. Put your pitchforks away. But hey, that's cool. I'm getting a bunch of classics. That's crazy. Got the Garurumon. Well, I guess where Garurumon is an Ace specifically is in a classic, but you know what I mean. Then we got Tentomon. Oh yeah. Okay, some alt art. <laughs> Hopefully get this on started. I'm not going to get clickbaited for that. It's probably rare. Check this out. Rosemont and... Yep, it's just a rare. Phoenix Mon. Nice. Then we got Bake Mon. It's a common. So yeah, how do you guys feel about these changes? The foil thing. Very interesting change, I will say. I don't think... Like I said, I don't think they'll be... Like, add too much value or anything. So... I think it's just a nice little aesthetic thing. You know? Not, not a big deal or anything, but... Hey, why not? You know, if you want to... Oh, got, we got them on another classic. Let's go. We got five SRs already. Not not a single SR or, sorry, Altar or Seeker. What the... I swear, if I get all my seven SRs before I hit my... Either of them, that'll be a first. I, I don't think I, that's ever happened to me. So I'm definitely... I'm not going to lie. I kind of want to see that happen. Now. I think it will make the video pretty exciting. Wings of Love. And then we got Tesla Jellymon. Shoot. Oh, I was going to say, what? I got three rares? No. I got Marvin Jackson and Shu Yui. Nice. Like, I swear, these characters. <laughs> Man, I'm not going to say anything. Oh, I was going to say, I made that joke on Blastix. I didn't even upload Blastix. God damn it. And I got some crazy, well, not crazy pulls, actually. But I got some good pulls. So, maybe I will end up dropping it. Since I didn't get as many of this one. You know what I'm saying? So. No, I'm sorry. I just got a message. But. Oh, I still don't know. Chitilamon. Chitilamon. 
Ginrymon, Togemon, Meromon, Lady Derrymon, very nice one. We got Wings of Love, Impact of Knowledge, is that? I don't recognize it, never mind. What the hell? This one looks crazy. Look at that. It's like just tearing up the whole damn city. Extra man, some of these Digimon, <laughs> you're just like, bro, what? How are you a Digimon? Are you not? You should not be a Digimon. You're just straight up a demon, bro. Like, what's his name? Apocalypmon or something like that? Like, dude, that's straight up a demon, bro. <laughs> that's one of Satan's goons. Like, I don't care what you say. If you summon that, I'm out. Oh, shit, Altar. I don't know what it is, but we got an Altar. It's our first one, so I'm not gonna, you know, spo maybe I should, because I'm not, you're not technically guaranteed to Alters. Fuck it, let's, you know what, let's just check it out. I don't care. You know what? I'll take it. Not my favorite, but you know what? I'm a huge cat guy, so... Uh, it's like I'm conflicted. I don't know which one do you guys think is better. I'm not gonna lie. You know what? I'm not gonna say it just because you guys are probably gonna think I'm just I just being a contrarian or something. But I kind of prefer the regular. It's happened the same thing with Batamon or Batamon. Like I just prefer its regular one. Yeah. But that's the one thing about Digimon though. Like they have such a cool uh, altar. Like compared to all other. Bandai games, like if you think about it, like look at Dragon Ball for example, like even the new ones. I thought they would, you know, start afresh and get some, you know, like refreshment on the art department, but apparently not. It's gonna look pretty much goddamn the same. And personally, I'm not the biggest fan just because, and I will be opening some Fusion World, so stay tuned. Speaking of Monday, and just uh, I don't know, I feel like so much of the art, like the background is so uninteresting, it's just like a blank background, like a color, like a random color. And it's just like Vegeta standing there. So, okay, that's cool. Or like Screamy. Like, what makes Dragon Ball cards cool is like how flashy they are. Which I personally am not the biggest fan of. Versus Digimon, I think what makes a card cool is the actual background, the actual characters, how they look. You know, what actually gives a card the more uniqueness to it, in my opinion. Versus, oh, it's flashy. So, like obviously I'm not saying all of them. Dragon Ball has some like pretty cool art. So I'm not going to say that it doesn't. But... I feel like for the most part, they don't really do backgrounds like at all, which I would like to see. Hopefully, they that's something they can change in, you know, more subsequent sets. Because I think One Piece also kind of started off with not so great art, but started getting better. So hopefully it's a thing they can do. But I'm not going to talk too much about Fusion World, don't worry. But just one of those things that I think Digimon excels at. Like the altars are always so cool. Like look at Leviamon. Look at, you know, like, what's, what's his name? The... I forgot the name of it. Uh, Apo no, Apocalypse. The, the Belfimon. Belfimon. Like it's smashing through like a like a pillar. Look at like all those different arts, and then look at others like what's it called? Uh, what's one of my favorites from? Oh, look at the Examon. If you see the Examon or that Gal I think it's Galactamon from Draconic Roar, dude. Those are so cool. Like you can see so much shit in the background. You can see so much going on. And I think that's so badass versus just the, oh, here's a blue background and here's Garurumon or Agumon just, you know, screaming. Or even the newest Agumon altar, like it has its little pals and stuff. Like I, I just think that looks adds so much, you know, to the character and so much uniqueness to the cards versus, oh, it's just another version of blank screaming. That's cool, I guess. So just one thing I hope, just one thing I really enjoy about Digimon just overall. That they can do so much creative alter. Kind of reminds me of Pokemon, actually. Like, how creative they've gotten with their uh, newest alters. Like, their actual illustrations. They, yeah, they, hell, they even call them illustration verse, as a matter of fact. So. Man, are you serious? Are we really going to get that, uh, the second secret slash alter in the final pack? Imagine I don't get it, I swear. If they actually change that in this pack, I'm doomed. I'm about to cry, dude. Let's check it out. Should be an altar or a second or a seeker. Sorry, a second seeker or a seeker. Oh, it's an altar. <laughs> Let's fucking go, boys. Hopefully it's okay. Where are, what are we going for? What are we going for? Uh, From the ones I saw on TC player, I didn't see all of them. So the ones I'm hoping to pull, fingers crossed. Uh, Garurumon. Where Garurumon? Sorry, it's where Garurumon. I think X antibody specifically, the altar or Apocalypse. Man. Those are the two that I'm going for personally. Let's go. It's a, it's an altar though for sure. It's not a secret. Look at you can see the little thing sticking out. And it has like a background. 
Show me. What the fuck is the? Oh, let's fucking go. Well, it's not. The, it's like success. But not really. But <laughs> I'll take it. It It's not Worker Guruman, the one I wanted personally. But it's Metal Guruman. That's still pretty badass. I'll definitely take it. And the final pack, of course. You, you had to see it for the final pack. You just look at that, though. Like, this is so cool. Look at that background. You can see all these missiles flying. You can see the, the aurora of it. Aurora. Did I really just say aurora of it? Holy shit. Oh, my goodness, dude. I <laughs> Yikes. Uh, anyways, ignore that if you, if you play Pokemon. If you know, you know. Anyways, you can see, like, the Aurora thing in the sky. That's so cool. I'm not even going to try to say it because I'll say the same thing again. Don't even get me started. You can see all the missiles flying, all the sparks. That's so cool. Versus, again, and, like, I feel like in so many of the other ones, it's just, like, a character standing there. It's just screaming. It's like, oh, man, that's cool, I guess. But, again, not hating, just critical or what's it called criticism you know friendly criticism but yeah this is obviously my number one i'm not even gonna try to hide it man this is obviously my number one let me do my other top mm, okay i got it that was a fast one actually well well actually wait hold up two i'm actually struggling with number five the most ironically enough funnily enough three four all right let's do it i got it It's gonna be kind of weird, but uh, okay, bear with me. Number two is gonna be right here. Where oh, it's not X antibody. I thought it was X antibody, so it's not. But this is, was the one I was going for personally. I just think it looks pretty cool. Like I don't know, it looks pissed. But hey, I got it. It's other version, so I I guess I it's a give or take. You know, it's like uh, Full Metal Alchemist teaches you. <laughs> but anyways. We got it. Yeah, Worker Rumonata that looks pretty cool. You know, you can see the little evolu mini evolution there. And eh, eh, looks pretty badass. Then we got Gatomon. Looks pretty cool. The alt third is number five. I just have to give it a shout out. But I'm still not sure which one I like more, to be honest. But this one looks pretty cool. It has the little buddies. I think that gives it a lot of personality. But I don't know. This one looks also pretty cool. Like a curious cat, you know. Like that reminds me so much of my cat. I mean, he, uh, rest in peace. But... You know, it just reminds me so much of my cat. And he was also a white cat, ironically enough. So maybe that's why. Maybe I'll end up keeping this one. I don't know. But I already kept Purelli because of it. So, anyways. We got Gatomon at number three. We got Tentomon. Just a classic. Honestly, I don't have any other reason. I just think it's cool. Like, even Supers, bro. Like, look at this. Like, this is just a... Like, this is more so what I would expect, you know, like, in the other Bandai games. Not One Piece. One Piece is also starting to have better art, like I said. But, like, Dragon Ball, like I said, Masters. That was, like, a huge issue I had. With Dragon Ball, like, I just was not that biggest fan of the art. Only the SPRs. The SPRs, I will definitely admit, they definitely did a better job at it. But, like, like the regular SRs, like, most of the cards are, like, uh, like, I just was not a fan, you know? But, anyways, we got Tentomon, just a classic. And, you know, like, again, a lot of little details that I think just add a lot. Then we got Gatomon, I had to put it, and I still think it looks pretty cool. I'm not going to say it doesn't look cool. I just don't know if I like it more than this one. But, hey, I'll let you know what I end up choosing, I guess. And thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks for checking out the video, the opening. Sorry for the <laughs> for the first half. Like I said, I just, uh, I don't know. I've just been packing up a bunch of shit so, and moving just a bunch of shit. So, just a little was a little bit tired. I did get a little bit of a second wind throughout the video. So, hopefully you guys still enjoyed it again. Hey, hopefully it's, it wasn't too boring or anything. But... Hopefully you guys enjoy the pool, the commentary, all that good shit. If you guys want to check out the second video of Exceed Apocalypse, uh, definitely let me know if you guys want to check out that uh, second video of Phantom Nightmare or Chainsaw Man or I, I guess I already spoiled it. Hell, Fusion World. I'll also be doing Lorcana. So I think my first Lorcana video that I actually upload. So definitely stay tuned. It's going to be a bunch of shit coming through. So definitely hit that subscribe button. Stay tuned. And hey, hopefully I'll be seeing you around. See ya.